Hey everybody, it's Carter from the PT Roundtable. Coming to you here today, we're gonna use our subject here, Ryan, uh, to talk to you a little bit about some of the proper positioning and the overuse injuries that Chris sees as an ax throwing professional. It's a repetitive motion that occurs again and again and again using the same exact movements, the same exact muscles every single repetition. And so again, we're gonna use Ryan here as our example to talk a little bit about the positioning of where you need to be in order to be as consistent as possible. One thing that we need to keep into consideration is where Ryan's shoulder blade or scapula sits on his back. Having your shoulder too high shrugged up towards your ear or too low can put some of the tissues around the shoulder into some positions that can cause pinching and that overuse like he alluded to. And so what we want Ryan to do when he's gonna throw this ax so that he's in a really stable position at his shoulder blade is to make sure that his shoulder blade is just up and slightly tilted back to create a really stable base. And he's in a really good position right now. What this does is this allows him to use his arm without any compensatory motions occurring so that when he throws and he extends his elbow, his shoulder blade's not moving. The only things that are producing motion are his elbow and his wrist. One of the things that we, we, we see and we talk about in our practice um, at Stevens Point Orthopedics is overuse and repetitive motions. We have our, our high-tech motion analysis software from Naraxon. We're able to look at how the body moves and particularly with ax throwing, we would be able to see just exactly how the shoulder, elbow, and wrist all work together Together as that ax is being released towards the target. Whether you're someone that's struggling raising your arm over your head, picking your child up, or you're an ax thrower looking to improve your performance, we, we in uh, the physical therapy world at Stevens Point Orthopedics feel like we can help in a Absolutely. really, really big way. Absolutely. And we're super, super excited again to be here at Section 715 and we thank them for their hospitality.